Right, as we continue our theme with looking at the best products of 2022, well, it only seems right that we crown our kind of, well, brand of the year. And if you've watched any of our top fives of products from each brand this year, then I'm sure you'll agree it's been an interesting year in terms of product development. But there is one brand that has continually surpassed my expectations. Sorry, that drive. They have in fact produced a lineup that has delivered on every front. In fact, even their putter lineup looks really interesting, but it's the only product that I've not actually tested in their range. This brand in 2022 for me, I've ticked a lot of boxes. First of all, they perform incredibly well. I think visually they've enhanced what they've done in terms of their looks. There is without doubt quality of product with the components used. And in some cases, innovative design has certainly reared its head. And it's at very much an appealing price point that many are offering right now. Yet my brand of the year in 2022, well that's Cleveland Golf. And it's Cleveland for many different reasons all of which I'm about to explain. Yeah, and we're gonna kick things off with the driver at the top end of the bag, and that drive that I've hit there is almost epitomizes what, and the reasoning rather, that I've chosen Cleveland as my number one brand of 2022. And that is because that wasn't the best of swings from me, but the ball still did incredibly well in terms of where it ended up. Everything in the Cleveland range this year focuses on forgiveness. That seems to me to be its key attention to detail because ultimately what they've done is they've built products for the masses. They've built products with forgiveness as being its number one priority and that can be found no more prevalent than in its range of drivers. I've played this for quite a number of rounds and it's very very forgiving. It's almost got it's also got rather very fast ball speeds off the club face in comparison to other drivers that I've tested which are way more expensive because the other thing that Cleveland have done so well in 2022 is everything is priced at a point that is realistic. And again, the driver comes in at a price point of 329, which is far different than any other driver that we've seen on the marketplace right now. So it's a good start in terms of the driver. It's where to next and why are Cleveland my number one brand of 2022. So working our way down the bag from driver, the fairway woods are all no doubt very, very good. But for me, it's got to be the Cleveland Highwood. That cross between a fairway wood and a hybrid is just the perfect golf club for average golfers. This thing is perfect addition for any average golfer's bag. It's got a shorter length shaft. It's got a head size that is a mix between in between a hybrid and a fairway wood, 18 degrees aloft. Ultra versatile in the fact that it's far, far easier playing off a tight light on a fairway than any three wood ever would be. It's a slightly different ball flight to a three hybrid. So don't get confused by its name. It's neither a fairway wood nor a hybrid, nor get confused by its loft because it doesn't travel the same as a three wood nor a three hybrid. It is a very unique product, but one that you have to add to your list. If you've not tried it, then it's a must. Well, Cleveland is my brand of 2022, but the question is, and maybe more importantly, what is yours? So uh, in the comment section below, I'd love to hear from you and let me know what you think the best brand has been in 2022. Now next up it's into the irons. And whilst I am a fan of the XL Launcher irons, which I've got in hand with me now, that's a cavity back pitching wedge. Roll out ball. That's a decent shot as well. These irons switch up in the mid irons through to the long irons into a hollow bodied iron. And yeah, they're decent performers. But for me, it's those, the halo hybrid irons where for me, things get really interesting this year for Cleveland because they made a super set of a, what I would call a hybrid of an iron and a hybrid put together. They're super forgiving. They are available at a set from pitching wedge right through to the long end in the bag. But if you watch a recent video that I've put together, then my suggestion is that combination of the Launcher XL cavity iron 
into the hollow body iron and then into these things is the exact way you should go. These make the game super, super easy at the long end of the bag. The thing is, it does exactly that so, so well. That's a five hybrid iron or halo iron as they call them. It launches the ball high. It picks it up off the fairway nice and easy. That wide sole is a massive, massive help to most average golfers. And it's another super product in this great lineup of 2022 from Cleveland. And then of course we've got the wedges and Cleveland quite well known for the quality of the wedges that they produce. That uh, zip core lineup and then you've got the, uh, the CBX wedges which are very much aimed at the average golfer. You might even call them a game improvement style of wedge. The introduction this year of full face grooves on CBX wedges was just a further development to just enhance what was already a real good set of wedges on offer from Cleveland. So yet another superb lineup an offering from Cleveland in their wedge lineup. Now I'm going to quickly reference the putters even though I've not tried them because one thing is for sure it is certainly a real interesting lineup and visually at least really appealing. What I like about these again though is their main emphasis from Cleveland is all about stability and forgiveness. It's the key message throughout every product that Cleveland has released this year. So that's it, lineup complete and from driver right the way through to wedges. I think you'd describe most of these clubs as uh, well, for the average golfer, let's say, nothing in their lineup suggests a player's club, if you like. So again, that's something this channel is all about. It is, of course, for average golfers, and that's why I think their lineup is so, so interesting. But then there's one final thing, which I'll just throw up on the screen for you now, and that's the price of each of these clubs that I've shown you so far. And I'm sure you agree, that's another reason as to why they should be top of my list in terms of the best brand of 2022, because they're much more affordable like I've mentioned already than many of the other brands and there's no sacrifice in terms of the quality of components and what they've put together. Well, that's a decent eight iron. It is, of course, the cavity back and those XL launcher irons, and it felt superb. They've just done everything so, so well in 2022, like I've said, and I'd also like your feedback. I've already asked what is your brand, but also if you've tried Cleveland, are your thoughts similar to mine? And they've done a pretty damn good job this year of producing a stellar lineup of products. Right, that's me done. Thanks for watching, we've got a lot of videos coming to you in this next few days, so make sure you're subscribed and don't miss any one of them, and uh, I will see you all very, very soon.